Hi guys, I'm Nisa with Nisa's Doodles and we're live tonight with our five and a half week old micro mini golden doodles. So these guys were awake and pretty playful about 20 minutes ago so they're kind of down for the count but I'm hoping that when I show them to you they'll kind of wake up and be a little bit more playful. So I'm going to hop in, introduce you to the puppies and then... <laughs> Thank you. And then we'll uh, we'll go from there. All right. So here we've got Dark Green. His name right now is Tater Tot. And as of a couple days ago, he weighed two pounds, seven ounces. There's that boy. Lime green puppy. Um, his name as of right now is Rumi and as of a couple days ago he weighed two pounds four ounces. This is Black Collar Boy. His name is Ollie. And as of a couple days ago, he was two pounds, six ounces. Oh, big yawn. All right. Here we've got Yellow Collar Boy. His name is Arlo right now. He is the big boy of the bunch at three pounds, eight ounces. Okay. <laughs> this is Orange Collar Boy. I don't have a name for him yet, but I'm sure he'll have one soon. He comes in at three pounds, two ounces. That's very cute. All right. This is the pink girl, the only girl of the litter. <laughs> Her name uh, is Gracie, and she weighs two pounds, 10 ounces. Okay, she's pretty sleepy. This is the blue boy. His name is Milo. He weighs three pounds, three ounces. And because I can't remember if I showed you the green boys, I think I showed you one of them. Let me just show you both of them again. They're just both right here. So this one is lime green, this is dark green, and they weigh, dark green's name is Tater Tot, this is Rumi, Tater Tot weighs two pounds, seven ounces, Rumi weighs two pounds, four ounces. Okay, so that's the two smallest boys, and for fun I'll show you the two biggest boys. This is Arlo and, <laughs> and my 
Milo, actually. Coming in at two pounds, eight ounces, and two pounds, three ounces. Okay. In the crate right now, we've got Orange Boy and Pink Girl. They're pretty snoozy. Like I said, they all, um, they all were playing pretty good a little bit ago, so now they're kind of tired, but it looks like a couple of them are up enough that we can watch them play around. I'll just pan down. So here, the five we got right here are dark green, light green, yellow, blue, and black. Black and dark green are wrestling. Um, light green and yellow are wrestling. Looks like blue is just sitting. Luna's right here on, uh, right here by my foot. So. He's looking right at her. Uh, oh, it looks like oh, Gracie was just <coughs> was just shifting. False alarm. But she's the one closest to us in the the crate. The puppy farthest is orange color boy. And they may come out, they may not. Where they've all been woken up and they went back in. I'm not gonna push them to play. Okay, so as you can see, they're getting a lot more lively. I wouldn't say that it's actually very rough, just, um, just definitely more active, for sure. So right here at the foot, We've got black and blue. Ooh, there was some good eye contact from blue right there. Dark green crawled back in. Let's see if I can shift it a little bit because we got some shenanigans going on over on the potty pad. They're doing really good about hitting the potty pad. You might have told, been able to tell it's uh, a little bit farther away from the crate. And here in this next week we'll move it even further. The goal is that they hit the potty pad no matter if it's like immediately outside their bedding. So they're working on it and they're doing pretty good. Okay, so green, sorry light green, yellow, black, and blue are all out. Play in. like, mm, nope, time to go back in. Dark Green already had that idea. He's the one by himself watching everybody play. And then Lime Green went and crawled right on top of Orange and Pink. So, let's see. So right here in front of me again is Blue. He's got scratching his ear. Um, oh, <laughs> sneak attack. And then wrestling is black and yellow. <laughs> Blue just went and piled right on top of green and pink and green, pink, and orange. <laughs> It looks like Green is still a little bit awake, so he's decided to chew on the bedding. It's okay, that's why we use sheets and towels. And... Oh, but maybe being on top of everybody's better, so that's what he did. We still got our wrestlers. Hmm, let's see. Were there any good milestones this week? They're eating about 50-50 milk to solid food ratio. Um, 
they're up for I would say about 20 minutes and then they sleep for three or four hours before they're up again um, let's see what else can I tell you Oh, you on the potty pad. Come on. <laughs> so, what we do when we're training potty pad is sometimes they just play and don't hit the potty pad. So the goal is we just place them right on it and go from there. They don't quite get it at this point. It kind of surprises them, but it's a process. They're doing great. Outside, <laughs> telling me that someone's walking past. So, sorry about that. One second. The nice thing, even though it's kind of Sometimes everybody's a little bit noisy on my adult dog. It's nice because then the puppies get acclimated to all the different sounds from being in the middle of it all, you know, being around my big dogs and being around just daily life as we're going around it. So they're definitely pretty calm around loud noises and um, this week we start socializing to a blender and Let's see what else. Um, we've been working up to outside. They are not interested. Not interested at all. Um, but we're working on it. It's, it's funny how some puppies are all about the outside and then, especially these little guys. They're like, no, we like the inside. We like being cozy. So, and it looks like a couple puppies are still awake, but just barely. Dark green right there on the far left. He's completely out. Yellow's awake, and so is black, who's the one that's moving right next to him. But that pile of puppies, oh, maybe Gracie at the bottom is awake. Looks like she's getting comfortable. They're all so sweet. Thank you, yes, they're so sweet. For sure, thank you. Let's see. So, yeah. They've all gone to sleep. Well, Black, Black is still awake. If you have questions, put them in the comments. Otherwise, I will see you guys Tuesday, um, 6 p.m. Mountain Standard Time and we'll go from there. Um, yeah, we're still gonna do one next Saturday. So, um, even though it's the day after Christmas, just to let you know. And we'll leave it at that. So, <laughs> thank you. Your puppy, uh, Lori, she's at the bottom. Let me point it out. That's her right there, the bottom of the pile. Snoozing. But, yep. You guys have a great night. Merry Christmas.